Beach volleyball legend Carrie Walsh Jennings felt USA patriotism in Paris, something special. Please subscribe to RZ News for more updates. For Carrie Walsh Jennings, the most decorated beach volleyball Olympian of all time, there's no questioning the personal drive she's had throughout her illustrious career to come away with such accomplishments. But like many Olympians before her, and those competing at the 2024 Paris Games now, the realization that you are competing for something more than yourself was felt immediately for the Walsh Jennings at her first Games in Athens in 2004. And though she wasn't competing in the Paris this year, Walsh Jennings felt strong patriotism from those athletes she did encounter and watch during her time overseas. I did. It's just something special, Walsh Jennings told RZ News when asked whether she felt the pride for the United States in the Paris. You see Scotty Scheffler when he won, and watching Team USA basketball, and their celebrities of the game. They're so touched to be representing USA. Walsh Jennings even noted that Serbia's Novak Djokovic, a 24-time Grand Slam title winner in tennis, was overcome by emotions after winning the gold medal in the men's singles. It means so much for every athlete to bring home the precious medals for their country, but after securing three golds and a bronze for her career, Walsh Jennings believes it's that much different to represent the stars and stripes. I think in the Olympic movement, Team USA is a shining light, and we are something to reach for, I think, in all the world," she explained. America is a shining light, and I think that is a responsibility that I don't take lightly, and I don't take for granted. Walsh Jennings was spotlighted throughout her three-peat in women's beach volleyball alongside her partner, Misty Mae Trenner. The dynamic duo were stars in the Olympics and Walsh Jennings understood the responsibility of increased media coverage and celebrity she wanted to bring home the gold. Of course, any athlete will want to notch that achievement on their personal bucket list. But Walsh Jennings said she wasn't just thinking about herself all those times she wore USA across her suit on the court. For me, something that just reinforced my spirit and my resiliency was the fact that I was honored to have the chance to represent our country," she said. Every time I took the court in the Olympics, I would invite in my spirit and heart, my country to be with me. All the service members who represent us, my whole family, my ancestors. Everyone who just helped me get there, and I brought them with me in my heart, and that is a big deal. To be able to represent my country and put my hand on my heart and hear our anthem three times with the Misty, and be able to fight for bronze with April Ross, that was amazing. Walsh Jennings also believes the Olympics reminds those in the United States, no matter whether you're an athlete at the Games or cheering on those who represent you, that American pride is never something to let go of. It's okay to be proud of where you're from, she said. No country is perfect. Embrace the good, and when I look at that American flag, our country is not our politics it's our people and our spirit. I think that s on display in the Olympics. Team USA always comes out with a lot of medals, and more than that, there s just so many displays of courage and resiliency and everything America is made up of. The players and the athletes seem to know that, and that makes me very proud. The pride of taking home Olympic medals will be even greater in 2028, when the Summer Games return to Los Angeles. Santa Monica was it, Walsh Jennings, who partnered with Santa Monica Travel and Tourism ahead of the men's and women's beach finals in Paris, said. The sand is deep, it's very clean, and it's just where you want to be, because all the great ones played there, trained there, and cut their teeth there. For me, as a young athlete coming up, Santa Monica was a big part of journey for becoming excellent. Looking ahead to 2028, I know we're going to have four amazing teams representing our country. Walsh Jennings will hope those men and women can stand on the podium, place their hand over their heart, and bask in the national anthem playing with gold around their necks like she did.
It's raw emotions in those moments, knowing you've made yourself and your country proud. She may not be competing, but Walsh Jennings is proud of where she comes from, and will always be rooting for those representing her flag. The Olympic spirit, to me, is what I'm made of. And the American spirit, she said.